The first element you require is to download a copy of Tails Linux itself from the Tails.net website. You will want to scroll down to where it says for USB sticks, then install from Windows and then you can begin the download of the required image. Further down this page, it will give detailed instructions on the way of installing from various platforms, using Bellina Etcher. However, you can still use Rufus from the Rufus.ie website and this will install Tails on a USB stick with no issues at all. Scroll down for the latest version, at the time of this filming is version 4.4, but you may see different. The last element is a USB stick. This one is 64 gigs and is more than enough for our requirement. Fire up Rufus and you will see the following window. Click on Select and go to the folder where you have downloaded Tails and click Open. All of the other settings within Rufus will remain the same and the file system will default to FAT32. All you have to do is click Start and it will run through the install process. I am not going to do this as I have already installed Tails. All you have to do now is reload your laptop with the USB plugged in, ensuring that your BIOS is allowing booting from your USB. You will now be able to have a fully functional Linux system. Tails will show you anonymity as you surf. Visit a website using the Tour browser and where you see the little path icon, click this and it will show you the proxy server's countries you are using. One of the wonderful aspects of Tails Linux is that your files are ephemeral, meaning there is no trace of you using Tails if anyone tried to track you. During setup, you can create permanent storage if you wish. Another aspect of Linux distros in general is that they have much of the Office software that Microsoft has, but it is completely free. LibreOffice software allows you to create .docx files that you can open up in MS Word if required. Thank you for joining us on the G-Man channel today for a short but we hope informative video. Please like, share and subscribe to our channel and we will see you again soon. Bye for now.